We all think we know former Hilton Head High Seahawk Puna Ford, at least a little. And he knows how proud the island is of the Seattle Seahawk, who's gone from undrafted free agent to a new two-year, multi-million dollar deal that could set him up for life. He expressed his gratitude to his hometown this weekend, and Marcus Walsh was there. It's Soar Day here at Shelter Cove Park on Hilton Head Island. I'm Marcus Walsh. Puna Ford, formerly of the Hilton Head Seahawks and Texas Longhorns, the great defensive tackle now with the Seattle Seahawks, is back in town hosting this great event to give back to the community that he grew up in. It's great to see everybody out here. We're going to get some great shots of this tremendous event and also talk to Puna as we continue. Back here at Sorday in Shelter Cove Park, Marcus Walsh here with Puna Ford. Puna, welcome home. Talk a little bit about this event that you created and just your thoughts on being back here in Beaver County. Uh, really, this event, you know, it's for the, uh, it's for the youth, you know, and just like for the young kids and the upcoming generation, you know, just try to like, get some, you know, let everything just come out and have fun and just, you know, play games and just enjoy themselves, you know. It's just like, really like a appreciation. Let y'all know, like, I love everybody in the love country and, you know, I just something to get back to them. Talk a little bit about some of your favorite moments as a Hilton Head Seahawk uh, playing for BJ Payne. Really like my senior year when we played Bluffin, you know, they've been, they've been like, you know, beating up on us for like the first, like, first three years and stuff, but like, my senior year was like, like to be able to beat them as a senior, you know, we go out on a good note in high school. Being born in Beaufort, you've lived in the low country your whole life. Talk about just being back and, and what this community means to you. Uh, it means everything, you know, you know growing up in Pritchardville and like playing, I'm um, playing a little league football, but the Gators, you know, on the island is just, I don't know, it's just, it's home, you know. And like, you always appreciate home, like no matter where you go, no matter where you go, how far you go at in the earth, you know, you always going into home and, you know, you always got to come back and like pay your due diligence, you know, and just, you know, show your community appreciation. How are things going uh, in the NFL post your uh, your time at Texas? I say it's going pretty smooth, you know, I'm making the transition. And, just really just trying to like get better and like playing football, just learning the game, you know, like film study and stuff like that. Just trying to take my game to the next level. Puna, thanks so much for a couple of minutes today. Thanks for uh, having this great event. This is first class. Congrats to you, and uh, we'll talk to you down the line. Thank you. What a great event this has been here at Soar Day at Shelter Cove Park. Puna Ford has done a great job with his team to throw this on for the community. Great to see everybody out here together. For WHHI Sports and the Hilton Head News, I'm Marcus Walsh. Now let's send it back to our WHHI studios and Robin Zimmerman.